All right, Catnap, I'm coming for you. We've got the Shred Ozer. This thing is going to shred him so good if he just could hold still. <laughs> he's moving around quite a lot. It's like he's trying to fight it. You can't fight it, champ. You cannot fight Shred Ozer. Oh, he's on the ground. Just got to keep going. Can we shred the other way? Let's just spin that. Yeah, there we go. Spin that thing. Oh, it launches them into the sky. It just kind of throws them up. I guess that's what happens when you get haunted toys and stuff. All right, come on. Shred him. Shred that catnap. <laughs> yes. Nice. I feel like he should be full of stuff, right? But it looks like he's full of, I don't know, red stuff. We've got a few of these guys around the place. Today, we're finding out what are the best ways to destroy catnap. All right. Glare gun is definitely one of them. Whoa. It put a hole clean through his head. It's even glowing. Okay, let's see if we can put one through his body as well and see if he's still standing. Come on, right there. Oh, that's not bad. He kind of turned around really quickly and we got some of his arm as well. There's molten lava falling out of him. Is this guy flammable? Can we burn him? Uh, I don't think he burns. Here, have a hot dog. <laughs> oh, it's knocked him over. And he's hurt his head. Okay, maybe he wants to eat some hot dogs. There you go. Mmm, yummy hot dogs. Eat them. Get them in your mouth. They're good for you. Full of mystery meat. There you go. Toss them into his stomach. I totally lied. Look at the way that they're exploding. Okay, I don't think that that one's getting back up again. Are you serious? Come on, stay down. Hold still. I'm going to try and jump him with the bus. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get over the top of him. It'll probably knock him over. Oh, oh, almost got over him. Okay, I'm just going to use the plasma beam just to make him a little bit shorter. Then we should be able to jump over him. No worries at all. Okay, there we go. All right. We can just throw that bit away. That's garbage. Oh, yeah, this one looks fast. Here we go. Right over the top of him. <laughs> he fell over. <laughs> it's like he ducked. Here, I have a couple of asteroids. I'm going to go over here and get out of the way. Oh, they're coming down. <laughs> the explosion is too huge for my computer. Is there anything of him left? Oh, yeah, part of his arm. Ah, wrecking ball. This is what I'm talking about. Let's go over, give these guys a bit of a slap in the face. And I'm coming. <laughs> oh, got him. Actually hit him. It doesn't really knock him over, though. But it does take little chunks off him. I wonder if it's because they're just so heavy. Oh, he's down. He's down on the ground. I just slapped his tail. All right, I'm just going to go over here. I wonder if the arm of this wrecking ball will do a little bit more damage than the ball. Yep. <laughs> just cleaned him up. Oh, the ball has come off. Okay, that's fine. I'm just going to use the... What? I died. I think I got eaten. I didn't realize this guy could eat me. Yeah, probably just going to reverse over them. The wrecking ball thing isn't as effective as what I'd hope it would be, but that's fine. Just running into them works really well. All right, come on through here. Right through the laser grid. There we go. This is definitely one of the most destructive things that I have. Battle of the Monsters. All right, we've got Catnap over here. <laughs> Chef Pigster. This guy is so huge and fat. He looks tasty, though, like he's made of bacon. I'd totally eat him. Catnap, that's right. Come over here. His tail is his best weapon. Come on, dude. Come on, walk. Walk, follow me. He's really slow. Come on, battle. Actually, but he's just rubbing his eyeball. That's not fighting. Oh, there we go. Okay, that, yeah, you just broke your arm. All right, I'm just going to get the winch and I'm going to just attach. Okay, close enough. All right, let's go. Get the winch to there, that winch to there. All right, that looks pretty good. I think they're just like stuck to go. Oh, he's thrown him out of the ring. That is so good. He's trying to lift him back up again. It's almost like he's eating his stomach and then he just headbutted him. I think the chef is actually stuck. I don't think he's getting off there. No, he's actually eating his body. Look at that. There's like none of him left, except he's almost going to fly off the thing. You might want to get back up again, dude. Let's see if we can get Jumbo Josh over this way. It's Poppy Playtime versus Ban Ban. Let's go. Got those tiny legs. They're just the slowest thing ever. Oh, here they go. Throwing his fist around. I feel like Jumbo Josh is going to beat him just because he's bigger. 
He's just like moving through him and just crumbling him away. Oh, Jumbo Josh is definitely winning. <laughs> These guys are still going. All right, he's down. Jumbo Josh has won. Let's just go ahead and slice through Josh. There we go. And then we'll just toss him in the acid. All right, we'll throw that piece in. There it goes. She's going to melt away down there in the acid. Oh, his skull is left. That's gross. All right, let's put this one in the acid as well. Oh, yeah, that one breaks really quickly. Its ghost is still alive. And we've still got Boxy here. I'm just going to go ahead and throw Boxy in the acid. All right, down it goes. Oh, that is chunky. Yep, he melts so quickly. That's how you melt monsters. Because it's the legs that he just flipped around. Hey, no. If you put him in upside down, he definitely gets wiped out by the acid. But then he sort of stands back up again and he floats as if he's still got legs. Hey, this is incredible. You can finally do go-kart racing in Teardown. Look at this. Look at that Mario. That's some RTX ray tracing Mario right there. Why wouldn't I pick the car that's at the very front? Okay, how do we start the race? Ugh. Do I hit the question blocks? Oh, look at these things. They got the piranha plants. Oh, you can, you can like definitely smash their faces up. That's fun. We've got a pink Yoshi thing over here. Let's just smash its face. Is all of them called Yoshi or just the green one? That's my question. Look at that. We've got the blue one over here. Like, is that blue Yoshi or is it Greg? All right, this is my cart. Let's go. Oh, man, I just smacked into a piranha plant. There's so much smoke everywhere. I don't remember there being this much smoke in Mario. They're <laughs> just crashing all over the place. This is so hard to drive. What even is this cart? And I've got like white balls hanging from it. That's a bit weird. I don't think I'm going to win, guys. I have to cheat. Come on. That's right. Let's go this way. Ugh. Crashed. All right. I'm just going to go ahead and spawn my own cart. <laughs> oh, no. It's too big for the track. Oh, I think yellow and green just died. Okay. If I block the track... No one can get past. That's my plan. Okay, I'm riding on top of one of them. Okay, this kind of counts as winning as well, I suppose. Look at this. I'm going to use my blowtorch to do repairs on it while we drive. Okay, now Brown, Brown is definitely dead. What's with these choppers? It's a Yoshi chopper. Can we... Oh, yeah, we can use the time stick to just erase it from existence. It's probably for the best. I found where the party is. What are you guys doing up here? What are these things you're eating? Some kind of berries. I just realized the real Yoshi's here. All right, let's just attach some balloons to him. There we go. Let's send this one to space. This guy's like super heavy. Oh, no, there he goes. <laughs> no worries. We have pink Yoshi. Or is that one Kim? And this one is Vin Diesel. This one is John Cena Yoshi. Orange has finished in first. Mario wasn't even in the race. Come on, Mario. Oh, watch out, Mario. <laughs> That's where you don't stand in the middle of the track, dude. Oh, man. Catnap's over there. He's going to destroy the city. All right. I'm going to get in this chopper. Let's go. How do we get the doors open? The, <laughs> the doors. I hate when you open a door and then it automatically closes again before you get a chance to get inside. I know it's not controlled yet. I'm trying to control it. Let me in there. What is this? A helicopter for ants? Okay. Okay. I think I'm in. I think I'm actually in the helicopter. Let's just get these, uh, the blades, the little, the, the things at the top. They're like knives for cutting the air. That's what they, uh, okay, we're going up. I'm, I'm working out how to steer this thing. Let's try a missile. Uh, we just hit a building. <laughs> okay, that's bad. That's bad. We got to hit the enemy. Oh, man, it just went to his feet. Was that like a dud? It's like that thing would have made a fart noise. <laughs> just when it fell, it just landed on the ground. Come on. Yes. That's the stuff. That's how you get him with missiles. Oh, his head just came off. Oh, that's good. How do we reload this thing? Oh, the body's back up again. Okay, we've got to take the body out. Okay, these these missiles are just going everywhere. The missiles or rockets? What's the difference? Let me know in the comments. I'm not really a gun or military guy. I'm more of like a bacon and hamburger kind of guy, if that makes any sense. Can I just use the blades of this thing to just... No, no, you can't do that. <laughs> Alrighty. Alrighty, so that uh, that was that. Now we're on the ground. Okay, so we do actually have, I guess, a bit of a spider invasion. I did sort of forget about these guys. I'm just going to get up here, though, because here looks like a safe place. Hey, spider, have a hot dog. What is it with hot dogs? They're just so fun to use. 
They're so effective. And they're so high in salt. There we go. Taking out all the spiders. Does New York have a lot of spiders or something? I've never been. Hey, stop it. Stop it. Just going to give these guys just a couple of hot dogs. Just to finish this one off. There we go. Oh, that one's... He's trying to do mouth to butt resuscitation. I don't recommend doing that. It stinks. There we go. Have a couple more hot dogs. Nice one. Taking them out. Oh. Oh, that one works good. Look at this move. Now we'll keep all the spiders away. Uh, what just happened? What just happened? I think we just melted all the spiders. We just turned them into a purple spidery wad. Oh, no. No. Stay away. Stay away. All right, we got him. Okay, let's get another army of spiders and see if we can actually meld them into a ball. Yeah, you can. Oh, that is good. Look at that. It's so glowy. Oh, oh, am I being eaten? Is this spider eating me? Okay, are these spiders dead? Look at that. It's like a black orb. Oh, that is gross. Yeah, look at it. All of their legs have gone. It's like getting a handful of spiders and just crumpling them into a ball, which I would not recommend you do that ever. You probably get bitten a lot. <laughs> What's that noise? I can hear some like scratching or something. It's like there's a spider hidden in the ground here somewhere. Oh, there's one over there. Okay, we better use the limitless technique. Here we go. Oh, nice. This thing is so good for destroying literally anything. I just missed. <laughs> It's not always good. There we go. Hey, there's still loads of spiders everywhere. Okay, what is this gun? Oh, that's a good one for spiders. That one right there. Yes. There it goes. It decided to make out with that building. Like I said, guys, if there's any crazy ways you want to see me destroy catnap, let me know in the comments. I'll catch you guys next time.